apologies for the loading screen. Sorry about that. Um, okay, I want to give you a quick rundown of what happened. Okay, so, first, um, I lost all my progress because I forgot to save and the game crashed. And then the second time I tried to record this, I accidentally pressed the escape button halfway through the recording, causing the recording to stop. So this is now the third time that I've tried to do this mission. Hopefully now I'll be able to get it right. Hopefully. Um, okay, this is basically the plan, as it were. So we're fighting the French instead of the Japanese. So apologies for you not being able to see their like special things, but I'm sure you'll see them in later episodes. Um, we've got exactly the same, t same team layout, same names, same everything. Uh, we're going into the mission basically the same way as we would have done last time. So, a reckless band of enemy hogs have been mercilessly wrecking havoc on the small island that makes up part of Hog's Head. Take your boys along and administer a sound thrashing to demonstrate the error of their ways. So that's what we're going to do now. Now, I do not know how many times I have messed this up, but it's very simple. We want to kill this little pig as quickly as possible. Now, I found from last time I didn't put my mine in quite the right place. This is what we do. First things first, we put our mine down. Put it here. Now what we do is we blow the pig into the water. The pig swims to the nearest shore, steps on the mine, and dies. Killing him effectively in one turn. All we have to do now is line it up. Best part is if he tries to avoid the mine, he'll drown. Now then. Lands in the water, swims back to shore, and dies. Okay, he actually drowned this time. Perfect! There's now three left already. It's brilliant. M. Shen. Gunner. Okay. Is that like machine? Oh no. Please miss. Oh, thank fuck. <laughs> I was going to say, like... Oh my goodness, that would have been absolutely horrible if that happened. Okay, so then, the plan is, I'm going to hop, skip, and jump over to the island. Oh, I said jump! Jump is in the square button. Fucking hell. Like, this is the problem I'm having. Like, jumping is kind of unresponsive in this game. As you can tell by the way I keep messing up. Anyway. Right. I'm going to blow up the orderly rather than um, the gunner. I think that's a better plan. So, I'm going to stick this down. Now, if we use TNT on the orderly and throw him backwards into the water, he'll drown. Meanwhile, up I go. Boom. The orderly is dead. The shelter's at decent health. Yeah, this is good. Fortunately, if that blows up, it might kill the sapper. I don't know. Right, how much health has the gunner? He's got 44. Right. Now then. If we get some poison gas on that gunner, it might work out quite nicely for us. Let's just go for it. Remember, things in the shelter can't be poisoned, so we're good from that perspective. And this is why we don't use poison gas. Okay, don't crash my game, don't crash my game, don't crash my game, don't crash my game, don't crash my game. Sorry, like that when he popped out of his box, um, it actually crashed the game last... Oh no. Doesn't healing uh, cure poison? I think it does. So it's not the end of the world. Oh, we failed. Even better. Right, so I'm now on number four. My fourth scout. So the next guy to take a move is that dude. So ideally, I want to kill him. Or at least make him in a, in a world of hurt. Uh, okay, let's just shoot him. And then the next person to have a turn is my orderly, my lovely little medic. 
They're all going for my engineer. I think he's just going to hit the bridge, yeah. He just blows up the bridge. Which is annoying, but luckily I can still get around. Okay, so this is my orderly. Hello, orderly. Right. Now, the next person to have a go is the guy directly um, here. Now, we don't have anything we can use to really stop him. So instead, I'm going to throw a grenade at this dude. Because he should be on about 24. So if we just do a little grenade. Oh my god, are you serious? He survived on one?! Oh my flipping goodness. Right. So the next person to have a go is our, our, our engineer. Awesome. So the enemy scout doesn't really have anything. That dude down there who we've been beating up on for a little while, he's basically, he's on, ba he's, he's dead. Like, I can kill him pretty easily now. So what we're going to do is we're going to stick a uh, mine down here, which will kill him. Then what we're going to do is we're going to stick a TNT on this dude, and then we're going to jump in that shelter. And the reason is, if we jump in that shelter, he can't jump in that shelter. So off we go, and ba-boom. Uh-oh. That was the worst case... Oh, no, it wasn't. I was going to say that's the worst case scenario. It's only the worst case scenario if the... Gu it's not the gunner's turn. It's the... Oh, thank goodness. Like, the TNT actually blew up the shelter, which is terrible. But it's the scout's turn. And the scout, I don't think, can get the engineer from here. Yeah, because the uh, bridges aren't in the best place. So he'll probably just hide. Uh, that's the scout's special ability. Where he uh, transforms into a random item. I don't think he's going to... No, there's no way he can get a good shot off from this distance. Okay. So. This is our enemy. The gunner. We're just going to hit him with a blunderbuss at short range. That'll do the trick. It's a shotgun, technically, but... Yeah, he's dead. And uh, he's not anywhere near us. Boom. Our sapper is still alive. So he's the only one left alive. Right then. We're basically safe now. Like All we have to do to win from here is just beat up on the enemy. The last one left. So all I'm going to do to do that is just get into position and just shoot him a bit. Phew! I'm actually kind of relieved. Should be able to get him from here with a bit of... And a bit a little bit better aim. There we go. Oh! The bullets curve at the end. Wait, is that...? Oh no, that's back on the mainland. Okay. The only thing that's annoying is that I've got my scouts, and he's probably just going to hide, repeatedly. And if I realised the bullets curved that drastically, then I probably wouldn't have shot from there. I would have moved forward a bit. To be honest, I'm actually perfectly fine with him just repeatedly hiding. Because on the plus side, if he keeps hiding, he's not going to be shooting me. And if he's not shooting me, it works. So now that I know, I'm actually going to pick up some of this health. The next, the next person to have a go on my team is the orderly. So I think it's important that I pick up as much of the um, stuff as possible, just because um, he will probably get shot at, and I would prefer him not to die. Wait, what? You mean he didn't take any damage from that at all? That's ridiculous.
He shouldn't. He shouldn't just take. He should have taken some. Ah, but he's not hiding. They will. Moreover, you'll get shot. You're a bit slippery, aren't you? Okay. Orderly, 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 orderly. All right then. Let's get you back across here. You haven't got the most health in the world, but that's all right. Actually, can I? I think I can hit a grenade from here. Let's give it a go. Why not? No. Oh, maybe. No. Yeah. I'm going to have to use my uh, engineer, I think, to break this guy out of hiding. Uh, triangle. Right. Now, we can't move that other sapper off the island because he's basically dead, so... We're going to have to try and get close, and then from there, try and do something important. Okay, let's see what we can do. Uh, I think if we head up here... You know. Oh, dear. I really don't want to show my terrible lack of skill on the recording. Um... Okay, let's see what we can do. Okay. Now, I think... Suicide's a terrible idea. But what we can do... Is, I think... We can shotgun him. And then the gr thing will blow up anyway. There we go. So it's going nicely. Excellent. Let's see how well this does. Oh no. If the scout kills the engineer... Oh no. Oh no! He's got ten health! He can't do anything! There's one... Okay, there's one chance for us. One chance. If I can somehow get over there enough to do enough damage to that scout, everything will work out. But that requires me being able to stick the landing and not die. That is incredibly unlikely. I am very bad at this. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. That's the first part. Here's the difficult part. We now need to do damage, and I've only got really... Oh, I've got nothing. At all. Like, the water's too wide. Okay, hang on. I've got tw uh, uh, I've got it. I've got to. Um, this is a terrible idea, but if I don't try it... Uh, come on! Oh, my God. If he shoots two of my men, they die, and I have to start again. Is he going to shoot them? Please don't. We're friends. I don't know if he knows what to do. He doesn't know what to do. Oh, wow. He's doing it! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Right, okay. We're in a spot of luck, I think. We somehow managed to survive. We now have another turn to play with. We didn't do any damage, though. You need to do 26 damage in one hit with a scout. I don't know how likely that is. Let's see if I can steal something from him. If, I, if I'm lucky, I'll steal the pit pocket. I did! I stole the pit pocket! Which means I've now stolen the knife. Right, so I've got a knife, a rifle, and hide. He's got a rifle and hide. I think we've just got to shoot him.
maybe a, a melee hit might have got him into the water, but I don't know if it would have done enough. At this proximity, he's got no poison gas. He's got seven health. Oh, yes! Yes, the AI is balked! Yes! <laughs> right. So here's here's the case, right? I don't know if it'll show up, but... He's got 55. We're good. We're good. All we need to do is land this shot. And, oh dear. Uh, yeah. Boom. He dies. He can't do enough damage to kill me. I win. Yay! Yes! Oh, that would have been nice. Oh, thank goodness. We did it. We did it! We did it, everybody! <laughs> oh, that's absolutely fantastic. Like, I really, I'm really glad we got that. That's brilliant. Oh, a movie! Okay, what's this say, then? Let's find out together. Ooh. What a nice little movie. But yes, we did it, everybody. We have completed the final mission in Hogshead. Hogshead is now part of the Imperial Empire. Thanks to sheer dumb luck, really. <laughs> like, oh my goodness. Oh, wow. Okay, everybody, we now have Henry, James, Richard, Charles, and Edward, all of them promoted at least once, meaning that we now have two snipers, two engineers, and a medic. But in the next episode, we advance into Sostralasia. Will our deadly and powerful pigs survive, or is this the end of their metal? Tune in next time to find out.